Today I'm grilling dessert, chocolate chip cookies and brownies all in a skillet. I put some ice cream on top and it's glorious. I'll show you how. I have some room temperature butter that I've just been mixing up a little bit. Into the bowl I'm adding brown sugar and white sugar to make my chocolate chip cookie dough. All right, let's mix this up. Just until the sugars combine into the butter and it creams, it'll be smooth. If you look in your pantry and you don't have any brown sugar, which has happened to me once or twice, you can mix a cup of white granulated sugar with a tablespoon of molasses and mix it together and you have brown sugar. Wiped down my bowl a little bit. I bet you're thinking, why are you making a chocolate chip brownie skillet on the grill? That's wild. I'm gonna show you how easy it is. This looks ready to go. To this bowl, I'm gonna add some vanilla extract. And two eggs. Let's mix this up. The wet ingredients are ready. I'm gonna move on to my dry ingredients, which is some flour, and I'm adding some baking soda, as well as some salt. I like a good pinch. I like three pinches. Mix it together with the forks. Flour into this butter sugar mixture, but don't put it all in once, because then it'll go So just add maybe a third of it, mix it up, and then just continue to add it. Start off slow. All right, last addition. Just want to mix it until you no longer see any flour bits. And then add chocolate chips. You can use whatever chocolate chips you have on hand. Semi-sweet, dark chocolate, milk chocolate. I just wanted these to be super fancy. <laughs> Cookie dough batter is done. Set that aside. And then I have a cast iron skillet. I'm gonna spray it with a little cooking spray. Make sure you get the sides as well as the bottom. And here I have some brownie batter. Pour the brownie mixture into the pan first and you can use store-bought, your favorite store-bought kind, or if you have like a bomb brownie recipe. And then you take your cookie dough mixture, and this is a little messy, but you kind of scoop it up, put it on, mound it up. You can't really smooth it over because this is so much thinner than the dough. You take a scoop, plop it in. I like making this in a skillet because my favorite part of a brownie or a cookie is that crispy, crunchy, chewy edge. And you get so much of that in this cast iron skillet. You get this whole edge in the bottom. I'm telling you, you don't get it from any other way. That looks like a hot mess, but I promise it'll make sense. So I have my grill preheated and only half of it's on and half of it's a little cooler. So I'm gonna put the skillet on the cooler part then I'm gonna close the lid. I'm gonna check on it every 15, 20 minutes, kind of move it around, give it a little jiggle, make sure it's not cooking too much in one spot. But it should take about an hour. Keep an eye on it, and uh, I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna go hang out for an hour, eagerly awaiting for this to come off the grill. It worked! I grilled cookies. Hoist it up. Place it down with ease. It smells so good. Can you see all the brownie around the edges and the chocolate chip cookie in the middle just kind of puffed up? So you can serve it plain like this or with whipped cream or ice cream. I have to try it. I'm going in. You know I'm getting an edge because that's my favorite part. I'm like not okay. Not okay. I hope you make this. This is so good. Chocolate chip cookie and brownie skillet. Make it.